Hey, hey, hey guys, welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Ever Crisis, where we're playing the first soldier storyline after we escaped from the island in the previous, well, not previous episode, but the previous story part, at chapter two, and now we are still crossing the ocean. <laughs> so let's see how this goes. But I want to say thank you for being here and watching me play. Please do subscribe if you have not. We did, in the last episode, finish the current Final Fantasy VII storyline. So, I'm quite excited to see when the next sort of downloads and updates are for these. Oh. Kid who lost his parents, living on a deserted island for the sake of his people. Brace my heart. We just have different upbringings and views on life, that is all. I know, but still. Glenn, what's going into you? Your paternal instinct's kicking in. <laughs> Are we going back? White smoke means he's alive. Good luck, kid. Maybe we're not going back. We're about to reach the northern tip of the island. Looking for us. That's a designated survey area. <laughs> hey, isn't that the monster from the island? I wonder if it's been chasing us. Oh my god, no. <laughs> You're gonna follow me everywhere I go? Whoa. Uh, that's it. That's what I'm gonna call you. Stay him. Shut up. Whoa. Oh my god. Glenn, I hope you're sorry. Oh. <laughs> okay. It feels like it probably could have put the battle then. In section two, the main island, blindsided. Okay, are we gonna just fight that dude again, or is he gonna have like, ow, oh, he's ruined the ship, hasn't he? Boats even. Oh. <laughs> Fighting on a boat really puts you at a disadvantage here. Yeah. I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting you to sleep for over an hour. Ah, it just shows I can keep my cool whatever the situation. <laughs> this should be the main island, right? Looking at the terrain, yes. A survey area at the Logue's Ruins should be somewhere inland. Well, that's gold. That looks steep. But I think I got this. Then you're on your own. We'll look for another route. See you at the top. Make sure to secure the area. Oh, come on. Fine, I guess we're sticking together. Uh-oh. This <laughs> just wanders up like... Arr. Okay, we just take rid of the... Get rid of these enemies kind of quickly. Has anybody got... Okay, what's everybody got? Thunder... Yeah, it's really all about Quake, isn't it? Okay, yeah, let's go for B. But what I'm going to do is just... Go for a Cure uh, on the map. And now go back to attack mode. Yeah. <laughs> Bye bye. So much better when you've got elemental weaknesses to exploit. Uh, I don't know if Balor Knight or Balor Jack is the one to take out. I feel like we'll take the Knight out first. Okay, probably just need to recover. Let me get some health. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, yeah, that's okay. I always forget exactly the buttons to push. Uh, go back to plan. Ah, there we go. Probably get another round. Probably have a big one now. Ballo Queen. We'll take the Ballo Knight out first. Yeah. 
Okay, I think I just need to put pure. Yeah, I'm going to I have not got enough time to do a dual slash. I thought I might do. But. Earthquake! Ooh, painful! Okay, now we'll go back to attack! I, 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 I can't speak Japanese, I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> I am kind of hoping we'll get some different enemies um, in this first soldier section. While I do quite like fighting the barrels, I mean we have fought them quite a lot now, haven't we? So it'd be nice to maybe get something different. There we go. There goes the queen. That wasn't really ever in doubt, I don't think, that one. Man, this island's crawling with Balos too. Hmm, could be could be they're allowed to throw freely dissuade outsiders from visiting. I wonder how many more will encounter before we reach the top. We'll fight whatever comes our way. Listen, that's what we we're good at, right? Right, but that doesn't mean we should be reckless. Yes, I prefer to keep the fighting to a minimum. I know, I know. Actually, in a way, I'd kind of sort of like to regularly fight. You know, sort of. Strengthen myself as we're going, powering up. Subsection to the site. An important job. We're pretty far up. We still have a ways to go. It's going to take me longer than expected. All thanks to the Balors. But we're speaking of Balors. <laughs> the path is rough and steep as hell, and it's infested with monster frogs. How do the Redorans live here? Yeah, this island is too dangerous for people. There are monsters everywhere. You look. <sighs> oh, we got some more monsters. Speak of the devil. Why don't they just chill out by the coast? Because they're territorial and we're on their turf. But this works out. It does. How do you figure? I'd like to gather as much intel as I can on the Balors. My goal is to finish as much of the beast story as possible before officially starting our mission. I was hoping to get data outside of combat as well. Alright, if that's what you want, I can help out. <laughs> what do you mean data outside of combat? Are you going to go and like, dig through poop? Ooh, poopy! <laughs> this one is going, damn! I think, maybe. Okay, we're, we're back to this one. I feel like maybe we'll just do a, a, a QRR on Glenn. And then back to attack mode. Uh, so that's about 600 damage from Quake Blow. Uh, okay, I need to see how much Thunder Blow does as well. So then I can see if that's a better move to be using. Okay, so he's not got weakness to thunder. All right, there we go. <laughs> that uh, teaches me that lesson. Big. Come on, will somebody just use some? All right, defensive mode, cure out on the map, and then hopefully Lucia will heal herself anyway. Or maybe not. Uh, okay, let's try dual slash. Oh, it lowers the physical defense. Okay, I need to be doing that, I think. Starting off a battle with that. Uh, we'll just take the knight first. And I'll hit him with a quake blow. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Put him back in attack mode. And then, okay, 
their defense. Intimidate. I don't even know what that does. Okay. Back to attack mode. Everybody go, 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 go. We set the battle night out and quick. Okay, look at Matt's health. That's not good. That's not good. Okay, that's a little bit better. Okay, so we're gonna go attack mode. Bang. You probably need to run his physical defense down again. I'm, I'm just now that I know that that dual shot does that, I need to make sure I keep up with that. Actually, wait, can I just probably attack and kill it? Oh no, okay, are we in defense mode? Oh, please stay in defense mode. Yes, we are. Okay, everybody's kind of healed, so we just attack. Bam! There goes the battle of Queen. I'm going to guess we're going to have another battle now. Oh no, we didn't. I thought we were going to have like, the king appear again. Go, Matt. <laughs> Thanks, you two. Their section's almost complete. Look at you, Professor. So happy. Of course, it's an important part of the job. Something I take very seriously. Right, right. It's just that I haven't seen you grin like that, so I thought maybe there was more to it. Like a cash bonus. <laughs> I don't know. There might be. <gasps> really? Is that all you care about? You're so greedy. Come on. Let's hurry. The sun's about to set. Hey, hey, wait, so is there a bonus or not? Hey! <laughs> I mean, there's a cash bonus for me for doing these missions. The greatest reward. Let's have a quick go. See if we can do it, you never know. Are we gonna... Oh, we're hiding from them now. I feel like a big one's gonna attack then. Look, Professor, the specimens are coming to us. Keep quiet, they'll spot us. I didn't think they'd come this far. We could get the drop on them, what do you think? Now, let's keep observing for now. You want all sorts of data, right, Professor? Not just combat. Stop with the Professor already. Don't think I don't know what you're really after. Ah, uh, the bonus. Is that what you think of me? Remember what Matt said, this is an important part of the job. You know, as a Shimmer soldier. <laughs> We've been spotted! Oh dear, my bonus! <laughs> and the truth comes out. Okay, wait, we're gonna, I think we maybe take that one out. Okay, we're gonna take the battle on this. Gonna get rid of the Balor because we know we can do it in very little. So why is the Balor weak to Thunder when he does it, but not when I do it? Okay, let's try Thunder Blow. It's still not weak. What's mutation do? Oh, I just raised its attack. There we go. So Matt does have something it's weak against. Uh, quick tip battle on knife down at ASAP. Come on. I should do it, I should do it. Jewel slash. Right, to this mutation, and then we'll just heal a little bit. Okay, back to attack. Okay, I'm just gonna heal. Uh, okay. I'm, I'm gonna go for a jewel slash on it. 
Remember, it's physical defense. Okay, that did quite a lot of damage. <laughs> okay, it's round one. That was round two. Okay, this is going to hurt a lot more. Dual slash. Okay, defense mode. Your are on map, and then come on, everybody with your are on me. Your cure on me, guys. I need a cure. I need a cure. Thanks. Okay, now we go back to attack mode. Ow, oh, that stupid thing. Okay. I'm gonna go cure on him, and then back to attack. We need to just take that jack out and quit. Uh, okay, okay, there we go. Morning rage. It's uh, kind of something different, I reckon that. Okay, I'm gonna just stay here, let him do his earthquake, and then I'm gonna attack. Because now I've basically got a QR for Glenn. Okay, I'm just trying to get up to a dual slash. So now we're going to go dual slash. Because it lowers its defense, and then obviously we can use my limit combo. Yeah, not quite done as much attack as I, damage as I was hoping for. Okay, it's taking him into the red. That's good. That's good. That actually, this is very good, guys. Yes, I managed to take out an enemy stronger than me, or the the recommended power. If I'm within about a thousand, I can sometimes scrape it. But then again, if I'm sometimes a thousand over, I can't. <laughs> My bonus. Are you still talking about that? You know I never said a bonus was guaranteed. Huh? What? I enjoy creating this beastery. Observing, hypothesizing, verifying, learning. The quest for knowledge is its own reward. What? You got my hopes up for nothing? Saying that, if the beastery is high rated highly, there may be a bonus. So what you're saying is, soldiers need to fight to make money. Oh, what a grind. <laughs> it does feel a little bit like a ground with all these ballors, I ain't gonna lie. Uh, a far away brain. I do feel like that's exactly the same level, so maybe we can do it again. Yeah, I think a lot of it depends exactly on who the enemy is. You know, if it's like those three rounds, that's a little easier than like one super strong enemy, I think. Whoa, look at that view! We should be able to head inland from here. Let's shoot for the Logue's Ruins. Survey the area once we arrive. How about we take a break first? We should rest up in case we run into any monsters. Good idea. Let's secure the area. Which is how we're going to run into monsters, clearly. <laughs> See? I don't know whether we'll be able to do that. I always worry. Oh my god, I've got some different moves. I'm going to fight some different enemies, I think. Okay, so it's just a blizzard. Maybe we just try arrow as well. Okay, it's not weak to arrow in the same way. Uh, I probably don't need to do dual slash. Look at that. Quick, quick defense mode. To be honest, I think mutation just improves its attack, doesn't it? I don't think it actually does it else. It's not like it hits me or something. Um, okay, we. Whoa! Somebody hit it absolutely really strong. Okay, I'm gonna use Glenn to heal, I think. Maybe we'll use Matt to heal. Oh, I think maybe water attack? And then back to attack mode. Come on, take him out. Yes. 
So remember that mutation, you can attack them straight after. Oh, if these are the enemies, these were not very strong. I don't know what the move was that somebody was doing. Was it water? Oh, I think it made be water. Has Lucia then got that water blow? Yeah, she has. <laughs> We're gonna have another round. Or is that it? That should be it, shouldn't it? Three rounds, yeah. There must be something else, because that felt really easy. Alright, good and rested. Let's head out. I shouldn't have to tell you this, but moving forward we need to be extremely careful. We're venturing deep into enemy territory. Please tell me we're going to fight some Redorans. Glenn, are you listening? Uh, uh, no. I was just wondering how he's doing. <laughs> you mean Rossin? Does he fancy him? Bit, bit creepy that if he does. White smoke. Guess he's alright. You can't even see the. You can't even see the chimney from here. I wonder if he gets lonely being so far from everyone else. Doubt you know how that feels. Being constantly surrounded by the cadets you train. It's more isolating than you might think. I can't speak my mind and be myself with people I don't know that well. Uh, Rossin doesn't even have that much. There's no one he can even try to share his feelings with. The dog? When we complete our mission, let's go see him. Hear what's on his mind. Sounds good. We can bring him back a souvenir. <laughs> a souvenir of what? Me food too. Oh, the dog will just want a bone, clearly. Or some meat, won't it? You know, we've already given the dog stuff. Far away friend. Okay, guys, I think that's where we're going to end this episode because we first completed the first three sections and we're about to establish a base, which feels like a good point to end. So please subscribe to the channel if you have not because in the next episode, we're going to carry on with the first soldier establishing a base. So thanks for watching, guys. Cheers.